Hey everybody, Larelia here. Um, I know it's been a minute since I did a video. I've actually been working um, on a lot of things, so that is a good thing. Um, so today is a very nice day. I uh, wanted to touch on some things. One, I am so happy. I'm actually, um, I'm at 200, over 200 subscribers on my YouTube channel. So that shows me that I am continually um, putting out value um, out uh, on the internet, uh, which is why individuals have decided to, you know, subscribe to my channel. So I want to thank everyone uh, for doing that. Also, you know, what I want to share with you today, I want to talk briefly about it, is that the value that you have. You know, the biggest thing um, that has been a hurdle for me in life, uh, believe it or not, is believing um, in my own self-worth and that I have value. Um, you know, I've did videos on this before in terms of seeking validation from others. Um, but what I'm, you know, realizing is that many of us suffer um, from that um, in terms of um, not knowing our worth and not knowing our value. And that's what I really want to speak to you about today is, you know, discovering what makes you tick and why it makes you tick and how it could possibly impact someone else. The reason why I decided, why I said that it's important for you to find out um, what, you know, what value you have so it can impact someone else. Uh, just recently, um, this past Tuesday, um, I had the opportunity uh, to speak at a school located here in New Jersey. I spoke to some of the personnel along with the parents on uh, rebuilding their credit and um, and dealing with debt collectors. And so I wrote that book um, that still continues to make an impact today. Um, wrote the book in 2011, updated it in uh, 2013. And the information that I'm sharing is still up to date. I'm not, you know, it's not old, you know, um, old information. But I say all that to say, that there are still, you know, people um, that are being impacted by that book. And I wouldn't have had known the impact that I could have made with writing that book um, until I wrote it. And so that is what currently, which is why I've been so busy helping other uh, service-based professionals, coaches, consultants, service-based business owners, the importance of capitalizing on their most underperforming asset, which is um, their IP, their intellectual property, their brain. What is it that you know? Um, currently, right now, I have a class uh, that is, it's a summer series class, and it's uh, two classes in the month of June, July, and August, um, showing and sharing with, like I said, solo-based professionals um, how they can capitalize on what they know. It's like I said, it's the most underutilized asset um, that we kind of disregard um, because really we've been programmed as um, individuals, as humans, that anything that you can see, feel, and touch is of substance and things that you cannot see that don't appear in front of you, especially now that we live in the age of information. I apologize, I'm outside. Um, the information age, you still have people who will try to have you to believe that what it is that you know, there's no substance to it because someone else um, knows this information. And let me share with you, you know, why I say disregard what other people say. Um, I like I said I wrote a book um, in the area of credit repair rebuilding your credit dealing with debt collectors now am I the only one that wrote this book no um, are there others who have wrote this book yet yeah, I mean in, uh, wrote about that subject matter yes um, are there other books that people can buy of course but there is only one Lorelia and at the end of the day individuals who decided to buy that book is because there was something that they saw in me that they could relate to that I made an impact that they said that they wanted to buy that book 
So please disregard those people who are going to tell you. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> please disregard those people who are going to tell you someone else is doing it. And like I said, the people who will tell you someone else is doing it, you don't need to do it. It's already there. Um, the area is too um, saturated. You will find, <laughs> I'm so sorry, you will find that the people who are saying that are people who don't have a book. They have not recognized their own self-worth. They don't have an information product. They, um, they do not know what their intellectual property is, which is their brain, and they have not capitalized on it. And they don't know how to capitalize on it. And so what they're gonna do is they're gonna look at you and say, you know what, someone else is doing it. Screw what she's saying. So like I said, I'm gonna end it right here because we're at the six minute mark. But if you want to learn more about, like I said, the summer series that I'm doing, um, it is a free summer series. Um, I am going to be doing it um, live. Um, it is a Google Hangout. And then, of course, if you're unable to see it, um, you can always tune it another time. Now, this is the caveat. It will not be on this channel. I've created a whole separate channel just for solopreneurs. Um, when I created this current channel now, um, I really did not understand the impact and the power of YouTube. So that's why you'll see a mix of things on this YouTube channel. Um, I really purpose, I really use this channel uh, really to highlight um, information and financial literacy, um, which is what I still um, am doing, still helping people rebuild their credit, getting rid of debt collectors. And I also share some things on um, internet marketing because internet marketing has allowed me to reach a larger uh, scale of individuals and you'll get a mix of that on this channel. Um, and then you'll also get a mix of just my life adventures. Like right now, I'm actually at the water park with my kids. You can see the water park. Um, right there is, is not really a water park, but it's a park here in New Jersey. Um, where they have uh, water and sprays and everything. So this channel is a mix. And like I said, I, I'm still, I still appreciate uh, those who have subscribed to this channel. But if you want to learn more things specific about capitalizing on your smarts, capitalizing on your most underutilized asset, which is your brain, your IP, learn to monetize it. I will put a link on this video along with under this video sharing you sharing with you how you're going to be able to do that because like I said disregard what the naysayers say yes people will tell you that someone else is doing it and who are you to think that you can do it disregard all those kill that noise and once again this is Lorelia looking forward to sharing more information and insight with you until next time, talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.